You know, I think one of the most interesting things about God's absence and how we feel it as Christians is the fact that no one is talking about it. It seems like we all feel a lot of shame when God feels far because we equate feeling far from God to being in a wrong state with God. Like we've somehow sinned and God has moved away from us or we've offended God and so he's withdrawn from us. But that doesn't always necessarily have to be the case. Sometimes God is just absent. And I think shame is part of the reason we don't talk about God's absence. But another reason is we don't know how to talk about God's absence. We don't talk about the fact that God feels far because we don't know how to talk about the fact that God feels far. But the Bible talks about it. The Bible talks about God's absence a lot. The Bible gives us lots of really good terms and ideas and truths around God's absence and presence. And so you just might need to know right now that just because God feels far doesn't mean you're messed up. Just because God feels far doesn't mean he's abandoned you. Sometimes God just is absent. And so for many of us, what we need to do instead of not talk about God's absence, we actually need to lean in and learn more about it.